to listen to some sounds that are coming more or less directly from Aetna, from a site, and uh, from text messages from, from the other side. And uh, I just would like to start. Okay, now it works. Okay, what we are listening to now is, uh, has been obtained, transforming into a melody, the string <laughs> World Year of Physics 2005. So you mean you took the words World Year of Physics 2005 and you transformed them into music? Into music, yes, into, into a melody, just by associating to each character of the, uh, of the sentence World Year of Physics 2005 a note on the pentagram. And so that I, I arranged it in a, in a pop version just uh, to, to make a jingle. This could a be a jingle, jingle a jingle, jingle, yes. Not bad. This is called technically sonification. It's called technically sonification, yes. And uh, why do you need the grid to do this? Uh, we need the grid because uh, to produce very high quality sounds, uh, it is necessary to have a very, very large computing power. So, uh, from this point of view, Grid uh, is one of the best uh, places on which this kind of application could, uh, could run. Uh, you can imagine that to have uh, just one minute of muse, or music, of high quality music, high quality sounds, uh, we need to compute more than uh, one million of elementary operation inside the computer, and uh, it takes uh, more than 100 megabytes of disk space. So you can imagine how much effort uh, from the computing power point of view is required to uh, transform into, uh, into music a huge amount of data to produce, for example, a whole CD. For example, you mentioned uh, the Etna that you are sonifying yes. the sound of the Etna volcano. Yes, from we, Sicily. From Sicily, yes. I, I'm going to, to show you, uh, thanks to a 30 second animation, uh, what we did. So we started using from a empty empty score. Can we get the computer image, please. Okay. I, can send it another time. The video from the computer, thank you. Okay. okay. Start again, please. I start again. So we start from an empty musical score, as you can see in, the, in this slide. And on this score, uh, we superimpose the shape of the seismogram, as you can see. So, so this is the oscillation of the, of, of the volcano. And according to the shape of the oscillation, we put notes on the, on the pentagram. And so what we have is, is the melody, and we can even listen to it right now. So the shape is exactly the same of the oscillation of the volcano. So in this, uh, in this case, we have just a melody which follows the shape of the oscillation of the volcano. So this is actually a sonification of, uh, of Mount Etna volcano. And do you do it just for fun? Or just to play some um, special futuristic music? Uh, oh, okay, we did, uh, we did this kind of sonification for fun, of course, and, uh, we are, but we are trying to uh, use this kind of sonification to uh, make some other more uh, scientific studies, uh, like um, earthquakes and uh, volcano eruption forecasting, for example. So this could be useful for a forecasting of the volcano eruption? Yes, we hope at least, because sounds uh, are extremely precious, because uh, it can be stored and can be processed and can be um, uh, studied with a, a greater uh, efficiency with respect to other kind of signals, such as images, for example. So uh, we are trying to convert into, into sounds that, that kind of uh, of, of information to, to, to try to learn more about volcanoes. 
Okay, let's just play, uh, um, play some more music, just a little bit. Yes. We have to go to Basel, we have to continue our trip uh, towards yeah. the video conferences. But just listen to the last piece of music and then we may come back to this later. Sure, okay, I, I'm, I'm going to, to show you a, a short uh, animation, just, just the beginning, uh, obtained by the sonification of the first paragraphs of the Einstein paper, uh, the one of the 1905. This and is music from Einstein World. Yes, and also the graphics uh, has been obtained in uh, transforming the text into, into images. And all this stuff has been made on, on the grid, both the sound and the, and the animation. Okay, thank you Domenico. We are going to put um, some application of this on the website.